Access to broadband service is a statewide concern and it is particularly important for people and businesses in rural Maine. Politicians promise to bring high speed broadband to them, but the reality is it's expensive. A state senator is trying to start a new effort to find that money. Here's New Center Maine's Don Carrigan. Farmers may need broadband more than most of us. The farm world has changed, so information can be as vital as rain. That's why Jim Buckle and Hannah Hamilton left their farm in Unity and went to Augusta. There's many things that we depend on internet use for. It's not an option anymore. Standing with their state senator to call for state funding to help them and other farmers finally get real broadband. We talk to farms large and small, new farms, multi-generational farms. This is an issue. We pay when a high school student cannot submit homework. And that's what brought a crowd to the Energy and Utilities Committee for a bill from Senator Aaron Herbig to raise $15 million to jumpstart broadband expansion in rural Maine. This is the year that Maine needs to step up and make an investment in reliable high-speed internet because the longer we wait to make this investment, the longer Maine's rural communities fall further and further behind in today's economy. The state has had a very small broadband program for years called Connect Me. Broadband is no longer uh, an option in most communities. It's a necessity. But Director Peggy Schaefer says that in rural areas, private internet providers can't afford the investment by themselves to get broadband to everyone. So there needs to be some level of subsidy either from the uh, state government, from local government, or from federal government, preferably from all three that builds out this network. Lawmakers in both parties have talked about the need to invest in broadband, but last year a proposed $15 million bond issue ran into Republican concerns about the size of the overall state budget and so wasn't passed on to voters. This year, Senator Herbig says she's trying for a direct appropriation from the budget at a time when there is still a sizable budget surplus. The farmers say they need help now. Jim Buckle is also president of the Maine Farm Bureau and says he hears about broadband from farms all over the state. We sell to, far, to restaurants in Massachusetts, so all of our sales are made online. We're communicating with our chefs and buyers. I try to take a class online. I try to learn a little bit more and try to push our farm up, and we're having a hard time just even watching the videos. All of it, they say, wastes farmers' time and effort and makes it harder to do business. They're hoping lawmakers will agree. In Augusta, Don Kerrigan, New Center, Maine. On Thursday, officials with the U.S. Department of Agriculture will be in Maine to announce a grant to help with broadband in several communities. We've been told by the USDA that that grant will total nearly $10 million.